Well, this is a differential analyzer, and basically what it is is like an ancient calculator. Um, and so what we're having it do is graph a circle, or parameterize a circle. Um, we can change the gearing within um, the differential analyzer to graph different figures, different um, curves. This is kind of our big project this semester, is that we came to the Science Center for the day to kind of give our um, thoughts to the broader Des Moines area. We're also presenting at Indianola High School and then Norwalk High School in May. And then last semester we presented to two high schools as well. Um, so we're trying to get the educational aspect out. I think it's really important to get Simpson's name out there just because, uh, especially with a different analyzer, I guess, specifically, is because this is the second publicly operating one in the U.S. So like it's a very rare device that Simpson has. So it's pretty cool that like Simpson's Research and Simpson Clubs are able to do these exciting things, especially being a small liberal arts college. We still have a lot of big projects going on to show the community. I think it's just really cool to see like kids as young as three or four years old come up to it and just like stare at it. It just shows like how even at a young age that people are really intrigued by like mathematics and like moving things of like engineering sorts that could really spark their later life adventures, I guess. I'd like to see them continue to do more specific outreach with high schools is kind of the first step. So right now the talk is pretty general, kind of historical about it, but you know, look at specific lesson plans for Calc 1 or look at specific lesson plans with trig or college algebra. You know, so like you could go to a high school, here's the class and here's a specific lesson plan designed for that class. That's one future I can see with it. I can also see adding on to the machine, the way it's designed would allow for an expansion, so I could see adding on and then you can do more complicated things with it than what you can currently do. These kind of opportunities are intrinsic to Simpson because if I was at a big university with 60,000 students, I, I don't think I would have that personal connection at all with the faculty, so it would be hard for me to hear about and get involved in these sorts of opportunities. You guys from Simpson? Yes, yes we are. We're all students. All students, huh? Yep. Mathematicians?